Experts have produced a camera that can operate at a coding speed of 156.3 terahertz, thz, SCARF. Scientists have developed a special camera that can capture 156.3 trillion images per second. This camera named SCARF will be used for scientific research. A group of scientists working at the Canadian National Research Institute have accomplished a work that shatters professional cameras. Experts have produced a special camera that can operate at a coding speed of 156.3 terahertz, thz. So this camera has the capacity to capture 156.3 trillion images per second. The camera named SCARF was designed for scientific research, not for the end user. According to the news in Webtino, SCARF, which eliminates the problem in cameras with slow motion feature, draws attention in many aspects. These devices photograph hundreds of frames per second. Thus, maximum detail is achieved in an image. However, it is not possible to conduct scientific studies with slow motion cameras on the market. For example, ultra-fast reactions such as the absorption of a semiconductor or the deconductivity of a metal alloy could not be imaged with such cameras. SCARF eliminated this situation. How is it working? Scientists used off-the-shelf optical components and a special algorithm when developing SCARF. In its simplest form, this camera uses a computational imaging method. In this process, coding speeds of up to 156.3 thz are offered to all pixels. This enables ultra-fast scanning of the image. The trillions of images obtained are processed with a special algorithm and turned into a single image. Moreover, SCARF offers lower cost, more efficient and higher quality results compared to existing slow motion techniques. Scientists believe that they can make brand new discoveries with SCARF because this camera will allow micro events to be viewed and studied. In this case, groundbreaking scientific developments can be achieved with SCARF. However, it is not yet clear when this device will be put into serial use. Canadian scientists have made an agreement with two companies.